Hello interwebs, welcome back to my channel, thanks for tuning in. Today is Monday, so we're going to do a movie Monday, and I still haven't rushed out to see anything new in the theater. There's just nothing coming out that really interests me. Today we're going to talk about a movie that has been out for a little while. It's had all kinds of mixed reviews, and I actually haven't, didn't know anything really about it, and that is Don John with Joseph Gordon-Levitt. I didn't know a lot about this movie going into it. Uh, one of which uh, I did not know that this was Joseph Gordon-Levitt's directorial debut. And I didn't know that it was about a movie basically about the main character, just all played by Joseph Gordon-Levitt and uh, written by Joseph Gordon-Levitt, that um, he was addicted to porn. I kind of, I saw the commercial and saw the trailer. Speaking of which, why don't you guys catch a little bit of it right now and we'll talk about it when it's over. Boys, my girls, my porn. Body pad, ride, family, church, boys, girl. Alrighty, so there you have it, interwebs. That was Don John. Um, I did like this movie. I, th I went into it thinking that it was just going to be this, like, meathead goomba type of character that uh, Justin Gordon Levitt was uh, playing that was just trying to get all these girls and hey you know in, in my directorial debut whenever that happens to the world I will also write a movie wherein I get to have a lot of sex with hot girls for my directorial debut why not good move Joseph Gordon Levitt nicely done good on you this movie I thought it was just going to be kind of like, uh, I don't know, kind of like a fluff film with no, no real substance. But I was wrong. There's stuff going on in here. There's a lot of underlying things, a lot of, uh, you know, underlying tones of, uh, of seriousness and with, the, with like comedic things packed in on top of it. There's an awesome performance in this movie by Scarlett Johansson. Uh, I really dig her accent in this and uh, I, I, there's just moments. Don't get me wrong, she's a beautiful woman, she's very hot, she's on my list. She has been for a long time. Hell, I think she's on my wife's list, I don't know. But I wouldn't blame her for having her on her list. She's awesome. Um, and just from seeing what she's done in the past and what she's done in this movie, there's just little, uh, things I'm just like, ugh. You're not, you're not that awesome hot girl that I, I thought I liked. You're some icky girl. Who are you? That was awesome. <laughs> that was a cool feeling to have. You know, try like hating on somebody that you that, that you, you actually like their body of work. And I was just like, eh, this movie ruins you for me almost. She, she's that convincing as this kind of like bitch character. I don't know what else. There's no real nice way to say it. I, I thought she was a bitch in this movie and I think she played it that way and I, I, I thought it was great because I don't normally get that from Scarlett Johansson so that was great. That was awesome. I liked that. Um, being surprised by her. Being surprised by Joseph Gordon-Levitt. I, I liked his like meathead with a heart of gold character that he had going on in there. Julianne Moore had a great performance in this and, and there was a very unsuspected twist I guess you could say in this movie her her character her interaction and her story in this it, it was great there was a lot of cool little you know layers going on in this and it was a very fast paced thing everything kind of got to the point um, great cut scenes of porn to be jam packed into a reg regular R rated movie and still keep an R rating that, that that's great uh, it's just weird because I didn't know that it was, you know, it was going to be this like more th that there was more to this story. I thought it was just going to be this kind of goofy fluff movie about some meathead just trying to hook up with a bunch of chicks, which ultimately that's what it was. But there was something else in there. There was something more underneath it. There was, you know, undertones and there's subplot and things for you to actually think about and for your brain to bite into without just thinking that it was just some excuse for Joseph Gordon Levitt to film himself making out with a bunch of hot girls. So I thought it was pretty cool. I thought it was a pretty cool movie. It definitely deserves props for Joseph Gordon-Levitt's first directorial debut. I mean, it's it's shot, it's filmed, it's cut, it's edited nicely. It's put together very well. And it was just, it was entertaining to watch. There's a lot of things that interactions between the friend, him and his friends, and, and especially with his parents, you know, Tony Danza was his dad in this movie. 
That's rad. I miss Tony. There was a lot of cool things going on in this movie. I thought it was pretty cool. If you haven't already checked it out, I think you probably should. That's really all I have to say about it. Go check it out. Tell me if I'm full of crap or not. Comments below, social media, however you want to do that. Don John. Joseph Lord Levitt. Thanks for stopping by the channel in webs. I appreciate it. Peace out. Enjoy the rest of your week. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Catch you guys in the next video. I'ma get mine, so get yours. I wanna see sweat coming out your pores. What? Like you don't turn that song up every time it comes on the radio.